Hey guys, it's Masterface2 and we are back with another Minecraft video. Well, in the previous episode, I accidentally deleted the footage and, well, yes. Let's have a sad moment over of what happened over here. We are gathered here today to watch Masterface 2 die like a noob, aka Samus 1 in a zombie siege out in the desert. Oh yes, I died in the desert from a giant zombie sage. I was out there fighting, and well, I was killed by at least 15 zombies in one group. And you can see I've got armor now too. So, in this episode, we're going to be finish building the house. So that'll be fun. Um, yeah. So I hope I got a bunch of feedback from you guys. So let's 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 finish building this house. I thought of a story I should tell you guys. Um, a couple years back, um, me and my friends were in Parksville, Vancouver Island, and we were camping there in the RV. It's like most people do in the summer. And we had this little rubber boat. So we went sailing for a little bit in the boat for a couple hours. So when we did that, um, we went onto the water and, you know, went around. And so when it, the shore started to, you know, come in, um, that meant the water got higher. So... We, we saw this island out there. It was a little island we called, I think, Rocky Island or something like that. So, we went onto that island. The, the water came up and we were stranded there. And we couldn't go back because the boat had a hole in it. Well, I guess I got to sleep. But... Oh, so the boat had a hole in it. And we were stuck on this little island. Oh, I'm sorry guys, I forgot to tell you one thing. In the two episodes ago, I gave you bad information. I told you I was in grade nine, I'm actually in grade eight. But let's go back to the story. So we were stranded on that island and we had no clue what to do. There was no way off because we were, we were little kids and we were scared that sharks were gonna eat us. So we stayed on the island for a couple hours yelling at people, trying to get their attention. Everybody thought we were complete idiots, so you kind of see what's going there. So after, let's say, I think it was about six hours on that little island, we finally got away back down by um, a log, I think, somehow came up, and we all climbed on top of that log, and we sailed back to shore. When we got there, we realized our, my parents that we were with were scared out of their mind. They had no clue what happened. So luckily they found us, so that's a pretty good story. Okay, let's get some more wood and complete this house. Can you make stairs with these things? I think you can. Okay, I'm gonna go out into the desert tonight and have a go at the zombies. So you kind of guys, so you guys can get kind of a like a feel. Oh, and that's where we went mining. Gosh, what happened to that video? I don't know. Okay, let's get that wood right there. I think that will get at least 1640 or something. Die. Okay. Let's get that wood right there. Okay, and I'll tell you guys, it's, um, sometimes it's pretty hard to play Minecraft and not die, so... If you, if I stop talking, you kind of know what I do. It's kind of hard to concentrate and talk. So, at some points it might be really quiet. And sometimes I might be telling like an hour and a half long story or something. Yeah. So. Yeah, I'm going to tell you a story. So I'm in Sea Cadets, right? And I was in there for about a year. Until ACR, which is Annual Ceremony Recreation or something like that. And at the end, they called out everybody's name who's going to camp. And me, I was called out to go to a camp called HMCS Quattro. 
I'm not gonna give you the exact name of the location, but it's somewhere on planet Earth. So, we, we, I went there for the summer, and there we did lots of drill, and marching, and I was something called a GT, which means general training, or twidget, to we general training. But we did band and stuff, we learned how to be drum majors, the person at the front, we did guns, we shot guns, we... <sighs> what else did we do? We went sailing. Um, me, um, I went for the two weeks, right? My favorite part was the, um, what was it? Confident Course. Now, you can find a GoPro video of that on YouTube, just search Confident Course HMCS Quadra. And I went through that, and that was fun, it was really easy, it's a giant military obstacle course. And so, I did that. Me and my friends, um, we had this, uh, dance. Um, my friend, what was his name? I can't remember, but I know my, there was one kid named Stuart, and he was kind of fat, and we were good friends there, but he's kind of a, a noob, kind of could say, but, yeah, so I did uh, something called a jetty jump with him, which is you jump off the end of this large dock, and we went, and then he went, and there's this kid down in the water who's having hyperthermia, and... We didn't know what to do, so we just kind of like wrapped around him like they told us to do. But that was kind of awkward because their legs were kind of like around him. But let me go back to where the dance was. We were at the dance and that kid, I can't remember his name, was there. And someone told me to get a glass of water, walk up to someone and just a plastic cup of water and throw it into the air. So I did that and he got pissed. So he, part of my language, but he poured the water down my shirt. So then I splashed him in the face and pushed him to the ground. <laughs> and then he started chasing me. So now I have this kid, fat kid, another fat kid, chasing me around with these messed up shades on through a whole division, or I mean crowd, of people dancing. Trust me, I crashed into officers and all that. So until that night, I, um, what did I do? I got these things as quadruples, which are wet paper towels. So I got, got them and whipped it at him all night until he couldn't survive anymore. So that's how I kind of got hit this one kid back. And it was pretty good. So a couple days later, while I was there, um, we did something called bend jumping, which you run across the top of the bunks and, you know, try to get the fastest time. Well, I did it and I had the fastest time there. But I went into this other block in the room next to it and I was doing it and I hit my head and split it. and. I had to leave the camp one day early, but at least I get paid for going to those camps and I got my money's worth. So, hope you guys like that story I told you. It was kind of hard to think of a story, and I don't have a script or anything to read out, so I'm just kind of like thinking of these by myself. Come on, don't run out. <sighs> okay, we gotta get some torches in here. Or get some windows. There we go. Let's go window right there. Okay. And a window right here. There we go. And a window right there. Okay. Oh, there we go. Got some light. Right there. Sorry, sorry, that right. Okay, so we're back. Um, I need to get a door going in this business. I think two of them. Yeah. Okay, let's go like that. That. Bring two of these doors down. Let's get rid of this dirt first. Whoa. What happened there? Nothing. 
Okay, go. Oops. It's okay, guys. If you just heard a loud noise, that was just a lap uh, laptop cord charger just falling. It's okay. I think cobblestone would look pretty cool right there. Yeah, it looks pretty sweet. Okay, let's put a door right there. Torch, cobblestone. Good. Oops. So let's get the pickaxe. Yeah, let's use a cheap one for this working right here. So we have to go get some sand. Oh, and also finish the roof part. Okay, uh, we don't have an, a lot of sand, so. should get the X, but this is just... Okay, now let's go get some sand from down from the beach. Okay, so... Um, let's think of something to tell. So, I'm hoping that later in this episode, I'm gonna try to get, like, um... Like a duplex or something. I'm gonna try to get the... Like, um, another kind of, it's gonna go like this, it's gonna go up in like a triangle, and then it's gonna be like a triangle pointed down on it, kind of like an arrow, then it's gonna be kind of like a duplicated house on top of it I'm gonna build, kind of. It's kind of hard to explain, but it's gonna look really cool later. Yeah. Okay, let's get this. I think that's enough sand. Okay. Let's get the sun into the furnace. Um. I'll turn on fancy graphics for a second. It's already it's sealed. Yeah, I'm gonna continue playing with Fancy. Okay, so... Oh, sorry you have to, sorry you have to see this. I'm just, I don't want to show this. <laughs> okay, let's get some window. Oh. Let's try to get this stuff as fast as possible. Let's get some torches around this house. Just around here, some mobs don't spawn. Okay, let's sleep. Yeah, let's sleep. Okay, let's get this glass out. One, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay. Yeah, let's get some more glass. So guys, I think I'm gonna start a farm going. Um, ooh, I need some torches up there. I think mobs are able to spawn. Oh, 
Oop, there we go. Okay, let's get that. I don't really need any armor on right now. Let's take that off, throw that in the chest. All I really need is a chest plate when I'm going out. Okay, is that one? Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. While well, that's going, I'm going to... No, whatever, I'll just take a stack. I'm going to make um, a hoe. So I can make a farm. I think it's like that, yeah. Okay. Okay, let's go outside and make the... Farm, so let's just plant some seed things and get some seeds. Okay. Okay. Cause I, th I thought it'd be cool to get some bread going. Kind of suck for starters, but it'll, it'll look better later as we progress. We're gonna get some bread out of this. Let's get one more row going. And then I think I just might end the video off because I'm a little tired. Sorry if it's sorry if this is gonna be a really short video. a good farm. Okay guys, I'll be leaving the video off right here. Please like and subscribe. Thank you. High five! Woo!